Hi everyone, this is Sandy. Today I would like to share you our new design mask machine. This is, which is our dark mouse shaped mask, mask machine. We can see it looks like a dark mouse. So uh, here I, I want to introduce the ear loop specifically. And we can see the ear loop it cannot be adjust the length. You have to make sure if you want to longer of the ear loop handband, you have to make sure the ha the material is in, in elastic enough. So uh, also here this area we can make customer slogan on late. And uh, that's all for the mask introduction. La next, we will go to our mask machine introduction. So let's check our machine from the whole appearance. And I will start my introduction from the fitting area. We can see our fitting rack have eight rollers here. That means you will have to install eight, ro eight, eight layers of fabric. This is our customer customization. And here is our nose pin material rack. And here is many to control this part. And here have total six pieces of fabric character. That means uh, two characters have to put two layers each. So total will be eight, piece, eight layers. And the uh, fabric character is many to make sure the fabric always in the same position to avoid you will go go too left or too right. Here is our fabric sensor. Each layer has one. And uh, here is our material. Our material will go from this part, and this is the below part. This is the top part. So four layers go through the below part, and four layers go through the top part. And uh, here is our nose pin part. This is the nose pin part. This is the gap roller and it is drive by several motors. So you can adjust, adjust by using the touch screen. And the next, and the nose pin when you insert from here. And so, so it will, so let's take a look at our sample. It will go put inside like this. And uh, here is our print first printing mode and the uh, logo customization area. It's many to print the patterns on the mask of this position and also the logo. And it's drived by an ultrasonic with 20k, 2000 watt. And this is the get roller. Here is our yellow station. And we don't have a specific yellow welding station. Our yellow will go from here, then directly inside to the fabric. And this mode will, will, position, will position the ear loop. Let's take a look at our sample. So, you, so the ear loop, so you will position this side, these two sides and uh, you will be welded wild, inside here.
So after this process, it will go to this mode. It's meant to print the V printers, which means this area. So here use an ultrasonic width. 15K, 2,600 watts. And here, use uh, ultrasonic with 20K, 2,000 watts. This is the get roller. And this part is to and uh, here, this Position is meant to adjust, slightly adjust the position of these two side. If it's only like if we set at one millimeters and the result is zero point eight millimeters, that means you can adjust this part. And the yellow color part is our mass cutter. So you will cut the excise edge of the mask. We, we can see here. And uh, this is the excess edge. So it means this is the waist. And uh, this also. So you will, you will cut the mask in shape like this. And uh, here we can see is our waste connection device. This is optional. If you don't want to the waste connection part, you can insert the material from this part. It also can connect the waste. And this is our com the belt. So let's take a look. So it supports two languages so far, English and Chinese. And here have some indicators of each button. Let's check our electric box. So here is our electric box. We can see here total have 12 pieces of Shinji silver motors and the two stepping motors. And there is a bus structure. So it will move fast. So that's all for the introduction. See you next time.